Remember the world's first surviving quadruplets? This is how they look after 10 years. Matt Davies and Catalina Martin had built a family together, each bringing a child from their previous relationships. Faith, Matt's 11-year-old daughter, and Callum, Catalina's 10-year-old son, were as close as siblings could be. However, Matt and Catalina yearned for a child of their own, a symbol of their shared love. The couple's journey of trying to conceive was a series of highs and lows, with each negative pregnancy test chipping away at their optimism. But in 2014, the two blue lines on the test stick brought a wave of relief and joy. Catalina was pregnant. Little did they know that their desire for one more child would culminate in a unique 1 in 700,000 occurrence. Catalina was carrying quadruplets, four individually fertilized eggs, a rarity in the realm of natural conception. In February 2015, Sophia, Aston, Amelia, and Roman, each unique and non-identical, were born, enriching Matt and Catalina's lives in Stockport, Manchester. Catalina's story is a testament to the power of hope, love, and resilience. When the first signs of pregnancy had emerged, Catalina was racked with anxiety, weighed down by her polycystic ovaries diagnosis. When she saw the positive test, her joy was marred by bouts of agonizing stomach pain. She feared losing her much-desired pregnancy. She sought the doctor's help, undergoing numerous hormone-level blood tests. During a trip to Spain, Catalina received a call from her doctor. Her blood tests had revealed something unusual. She returned to a sea of apprehension, plagued by thoughts of ectomic pregnancy and its implications. The sonographer's silence during the ultrasound did nothing to ease her fears. However, the news she received was unexpected. The sonographer detected three, possibly four, gestational sacs. The realization that she was carrying quadruplets was as overwhelming as it was surprising. The doctor's confirmation sent Catalina into a whirlwind of emotions. She was thrilled about her pregnancy, but fearful about the monumental task of raising quadruplets. The offer to terminate one or two of the pregnancies was a difficult one to grapple with. However, Catalina was determined to give each baby a chance, despite the associated risks. Her pregnancy journey was marked by morning sickness, an enormous belly, and constant worry. She had to relinquish her job as a hairdresser due to her ever-growing bump, which often led to disbelief among her clients. However, the realization that each baby was unique and individually conceived gave her strength. Her delivery, scheduled for 32 weeks, was preponed to 30 weeks due to her development of preeclampsia. Sophia, Roman, Aston, and Amelia were born safely, their weights ranging from 2 pounds 13 ounces to 3 pounds 11 ounces. Relief washed over Catalina as she held her four healthy babies. Raising the quadruplets was no easy task. The costs, both financial and emotional, were high. Their daily necessities cost 200 pounds per week, and their care demanded Catalina's constant attention. Despite this, the joy they brought to their parents' lives was priceless. Each child had a distinct personality. Aston was always cheerful. Sophia loved her food and was quite placid. Roman was the smallest but also the loudest, and Amelia had a charm that everyone found irresistible. Catalina, despite her daily fears and worries, wouldn't trade her life for anything. The quadruplet's fourth birthday marked a significant milestone for the family. Matt and Catalina decided to tie the knot, with their four children acting as bridesmaids and page boys. This momentous occasion was a testament to their love and the remarkable journey they had embarked upon together. As their little ones trotted down the aisle in their matching outfits, the pride on Matt and Catalina's faces was palpable. The presence of all six children, including Faith and Callum, completed their special day. The venue was decorated with an elegant simplicity, mirroring Matt and Catalina's understated charm. The air was filled with laughter, shared memories, and the unspoken promise of many more joyous years to come. It was a day of celebration and gratitude, one that acknowledged their trials and tribulations and celebrated the beautiful family they had formed. Amelia and Sophia, the two young girls, looked adorable in their floral dresses, their hair adorned with a ring of fresh flowers as they walked down the aisle. They stole the hearts of the guests. The boys, Aston and Roman, were equally charming in their little tuxedos. Their infectious smiles brought a wave of warmth to the celebration. 
Following the exchange of vows, the newlyweds and their guests moved to a local golf club for the reception. It was a grand event filled with heartfelt toasts, laughter, and the infectious energy of the children. The couple danced their first dance as husband and wife, their eyes glistening with unshed tears of joy. The children, too, joined in, their innocent laughter amplifying the joyous atmosphere. The celebration continued late into the night, with everyone cherishing this special day in Matt and Catalina's lives. Their journey, however, was not without challenges. The quadruplets, despite being a source of immeasurable happiness, also brought about significant changes in Matt and Catalina's lives. Every day was a new learning experience filled with unique trials and tribulations. The couple had to keep an eye on the children constantly, ensuring they were safe, especially during outdoor activities. Financially, too, things had become more complex. The couple now had to be more mindful of their expenses, often seeking out deals and discounts to manage their budget. Yet, despite the challenges, Matt and Catalina found immense joy in their expanded family. The everyday chaos and cacophony of the children's laughter and the satisfaction of seeing them grow up together made every struggle worth it. The couple often found themselves marveling at their children's unique personalities and the bond they shared. The quadruplets' distinct traits and behaviors often left Matt and Catalina in awe. Sophia, with her love for food, was the first to run to the dining table every mealtime. Aston, with his perpetual smile, could lighten the mood in any situation. Roman, despite being the smallest, was the most vocal, often surprising everyone with his loud but endearing antics. Amelia, the little charmer, was adored by all, her infectious laughter a source of joy in the Davis-Martin household. Their unique birth story, beating incredible odds to be born without IVF, made them a topic of intrigue and admiration among friends, family, and even the medical community. The fact that they were non-identical quadruplets, each conceived from a separate fertilized egg, made them a unique case, something that was often brought up in conversations. Their story was a testament to the miracles of life, a beacon of hope for many. Despite the everyday chaos, Matt and Catalina were grateful for their life. Every day brought new challenges, but it also brought countless moments of joy and love. They watched their children grow, their personalities evolve, and their bonds strengthen. And with every passing day, their conviction in their decision to give each child a chance grew stronger. Matt and Catalina's love story was not just about their union, but also about their extraordinary journey of parenthood. Their story became a source of inspiration for many, illustrating the power of love, hope, and resilience. They were often approached by friends, family, and even strangers curious about their unique journey, and they shared their story with pride and honesty. Despite the inevitable challenges, Matt and Catalina were firm believers in focusing on the brighter side of things. They loved their large family and wouldn't have had it any other way. They found joy in the little things, the matching outfits, the quadruplets wore, the way they bickered over toys, their collective laughter at silly jokes, and their enthusiastic chatter about their day at school. At bedtime, the couple found solace in their quiet routine, tucking each child in, sharing bedtime stories, and whispering words of love. As they kissed their children goodnight, they were reminded of the incredible journey they'd been on, the odds they had beaten, and the beautiful family they'd created. Education was another aspect they gave great importance to. They wanted to provide their children with the best opportunities to learn and grow. Catalina often turned their living room into a makeshift classroom, engaging the children in craft projects, reading sessions, and educational games. Matt, on the other hand, made sure to teach them the importance of kindness, honesty, and hard work. The bond between the siblings was something that warmed Matt and Catalina's heart. Faith and Callum, despite being from their previous relationships, loved the quadruplets as their own siblings. They often took on the roles of older siblings, guiding the quadruplets, playing with them, and even helping their parents in taking care of them. This close-knit bond among the siblings was a source of immense happiness for the couple. Matt and Catalina also prioritized quality family time. Despite their busy schedules and the challenges of raising a large family, they ensured that they spent time together as a family. Whether it was enjoying a meal together, going for walks in the park, or simply cuddling up for a movie night, these moments were precious to them. The couple's story is a testament to the unexpected twists and turns of life. What started as a desire for one more child turned into a journey filled with surprises, challenges, and immense joy. 
Despite the hardships, Matt and Catalina wouldn't change a thing. Their life was filled with love, laughter, and four unique bundles of joy that made every struggle worth it. Their journey from their initial struggle to conceive to the surprise of quadruplets and the subsequent challenges of raising them was a testament to their strength and love. Their story was a beacon of hope for many struggling with fertility issues, a story that reassured them that miracles do happen. In the end, Matt and Catalina realized that their desire to have one more child had been granted in the most unexpected way. Their family was now complete. They had six beautiful children, each unique in their own way, filling their lives with love and happiness. They knew they had their hands full, and any thoughts of trying for another baby were put to rest. Their family was perfect just the way it was, and they were more than content. As they watched their children grow, learn, and explore the world, they felt a sense of fulfillment. Their hearts were full, and their home was filled with laughter, love, and occasional chaos. But that was the beauty of their life, unpredictable, challenging, but immensely rewarding. In the end, they had their love for each other, their incredible journey, and their six wonderful children to be thankful for.